boss lady here. The five foot ten coming with the rough. With neck one of hip hop's business. greatest, if not the greatest, I don't know. I'll take but the I'll take interpreter of the culture behind the camera. It is Jonathan uh, Mannion. One of them, man. Yo, God bless. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. We are tributing you tonight, Jonathan Mannion. Thank you very much. For your incredible career. You are a monster. You are indeed a monster. And we're talking like monster inspiration. Where does Jonathan Mannion get the inspiration to take iconic images as you do? Man, I think it's something that just like, it sounds cheesy, but it definitely comes from within, man. It's like, it's something that you have or you don't. You know? Craft can be learned, but passion is something that just like burns from within. This is something I've chased for a really long time. You know, like since like 19, basically 89, Big Daddy Kane, Cool Mo D, Ice T, like, you know, that whole run made me want to be part of this movement. And in 93, when I had a chance to attach to it, I chased it full force, man. And like, really kicked off the career in 1996 with Jay Z, Reasonable Doubt. Not a bad kickoff, man, to a career, man, I have to say. Did you hear that? Jay Z's Reasonable Doubt artwork. My first album cover and his first album. I shot Biggie before then and Tyson Beckford, <laughs> the king. You and Jay keep a relationship to this day? Yeah, we did uh, We did eight album covers together. And uh, yeah, still speaking, man. You know, it's like, yo, know, the guy is like Obama, man. You know, you have to like only respect him for the, the work that he's established for everybody to kind of follow. Yeah. You know, he's really he's led the charge, man. He's shown them like a great example of how it's to be done. So many have, you know, Dr. Dre, like good businessman, 50 Cent, and like everybody has, you know, they've led the way like solidly. Jay, there's a certain passion that is attached to what he's done for culture that I think has really like made people kind of believe in the way, man, and certainly I'm one of those people. Well, speaking, I mean, you've worked with the legends in the game, and now you're working with new legends. Oh, yeah. Like, you get to work with, now tell us the story behind this particular shoot. So, the particular shoot, it. the particular shoot behind me, which I know is Drake, Champagne Poppy, follow him. He's got like 4.4 million followers. Okay. Like, he may or may not need a follower. But, you know, like one thing that really rings true, man, he's always been consistent. I, I photographed him for the Fader magazine um, back in like uh, 2008 or nine. The, his first ever magazine cover. I photographed him on the three day transition between him signing the deal, not having a deal to signing it, to going home to Toronto to celebrate. That was the first time I worked with him. So this is a continuation. The picture behind me is a continuation of that moment. And I shot it on an 8x10 Deardorff field camera that I learned the technique from Richard Avedon. Shot on a 4x5 reducing bag. It's all technical stuff, man. You can look it up. It's a real thing. But Type 55 Polaroid. They don't even make it anymore. I saved it for six years. This behind me is the last sheet of film to be made that I personally own. There may be a couple floating around, but this was it, man. I, I felt like he deserved it. I felt like he deserved to close out a chapter, and uh, and certainly I'm. And that, and that shot, that shot is iconic. And the best part about it is, we're talking about inspiration tonight. So, like you said, you get these artists as they're going from struggling to making a big, and you get them at that pivotal point. If that's not inspiring, I don't, I don't know what is. Man, I've been, I've been fortunate to work with people, man. Like whether it's like the first album, and then they get set free. You know, or a continuation, which is this, you know, this image behind me is that, you know? Like, all the all the power was out in Toronto. There was no power. And I said, my pictures don't change one bit whether I have power or not. Because I understand my craft, you know? So this was like that moment of like, I got a generator, it happened, we continued, and this was made. You and know, tonight, it's like, and, tonight, and everything is crispy and sharp to the herringbone chain, to the Versace jacket, to him looking sharp to the details that photographers love. You know, like, it's important. You know, it's it's in the details. And tonight what we're doing, all of your photos are being displayed and we have the monster headphones where people can listen on iPads to Jonathan, yes. to Jonathan doing interviews and, re and speaking about the behind the scenes of every shoot. No, cheers, so. man. 
Yo, that's been the most rewarding thing I think that I've given back to this event tonight. Gil Green is incredible. You know, 305 I've done a lot of work in. I was here last year, I didn't make a contribution beyond the vibes. Today, I wanted to deliver not only the images like, hey, nice picture, I know that one, nice picture, I know that one, but like I wanted to give people an insight to my process, what the artist said, and like how we arrived at this one single picture. You know, and I think what's beautiful, it's like a perfect event because the vibes are loud outside. You know, the tunes are running. So to put on the monster headphones and be able to tune out the world and only have this moment to like spend with the artist and what I said was special, man. It's a testament to Monster, how effective the headphones are, but also like, you know, really just like a perfect like synergy between everything that we wanted to achieve, you know? Amen. And we done it. I need to go listen to all of those interviews yeah. right now. Salute to you, Jonathan Mannion, an absolute legend in the game. You are inspiring. Thank you. I really appreciate it, man. It's an honor to do what I do, to bring the message to the people. And it's real and it's gonna continue, man. It does not stop in 2013. Can't stop, on, won't stop. We keep and going. And on, and on. <laughs>